Today is a very special day. I'm going to show you how to use the Meme Launcher 3000. I've stripped this down to just the virtual reality map and all the basic elements. Let's see what's inside. You can see a few options here. Uh, increase and decrease boost power. Increase, decrease flight time. Three launch options. And the ability to lock and unlock the launcher. Uh, I'm the set commander, so I have all these options available to me right now, including locking and unlocking. I can unlock it for other any other person to use it if they wish. That's helpful if you're leaving base and want to leave it to be available for chips. All right, let's see. Try to create it for the tactical nuke and I don't have any plutonium available for a dirty bomb right now. I can do a remote designator. There are the cute little guys right on top. I've now been given the option to initiate flight sequence. And uh, for this purpose of this uh, little test mission, I've given myself the UAV ability as well. Okay. The power and flight time, as well as the um, barrel height and direction are all on default right now. Let's see where it goes. And I can take control of the UAV turret. Parachutes have deployed. They will deploy any second. And we're gonna fall and fall. And once it hits the ground, the uh, sub disappears. Alright. Let's do the transport pod. But first, let's look at the map. You see a little bit of information on that map marker as to where the parachute deployed. And all that information is uh, recorded inside of the uh, briefing stuff over here. Pretty useful if you want to line up other shots and figure out what you did before. The map marker does delete after a few minutes. Let's see, how far did that travel? Four kilometers. Not bad. On the default settings. This is the transport pod, you can get in it. Let's crank up the power. And the flight time. It's on max. There she goes. It'll take 20 seconds before the parachute deploys. The VR map is uh, pretty small. It's about 10 kilometers square. It'll shoot out of the range of the map. Okay, there it is. 
Yeah, we can't see it. Grid coordinates, 0, 06, 1, 1, 2, 1. Compared to the first launch, and the Y coordinates, 0, 4, 0 on the first, 1, 2, 1 on the second. So she traveled about 12 kilometers. Let's go get some plutonium. should now have the ability to create a dirty nuke. There it is. And let's do the other other extremity. Least power and flight time. Could show you two when you get in the gunner seat to you can move it to different angles and unfortunately when you move it around it doesn't look so good but nothing's perfect you can raise and lower the turret as well let's raise it up high Shoot it off. Parachute deployed. There's the dirty nuke. That's all there is to it. Hope you enjoyed, and I hope you learned something. Take care.